are following breaking news out of Southwest Miami-Dade where three people, including a child, are dead. This is after a shooting right outside of a Chase Bank. Police are calling it a murder-suicide. Local 10 News report, reporter Syra Onor is alive on the scene. She has some new surveillance video of the gunman. Syra. Alexis, this horrible incident, three people dead, part of it caught on cell phone video. We're going to show it to you. I want to warn you, uh, it is disturbing. While you don't see the victims, you do see what appears to be the gunman firing into one of those vehicles. He just Oh my God. Cell phone video from a witness shows an armed man getting into a car after it appears he just fired a gunshot into a vehicle next to him in the ATM oh line. Hey, they just killed someone. The witnesses wave down a police officer. They're shooting over They're there. Killing. Police surround the Chase Bank where they say three people were found shot dead. One of the victims, a small child. It appears that the female uh, in a minivan with the child was pulling up to a, to a bank behind me. Um, I don't know what exactly she was doing at the bank. She was at the ATM line when uh, an unknown subject pulled in, pulled next to her in an SUV and opened fire, killing both the female and the child and then killing himself. Police say the gunman shot and killed himself after killing the woman and child in the minivan. Sky 10 shows the shot up vehicle from above. The intersection closed at the scene of the heinous crime at the Chase Bank near Bird Road and Southwest 152nd Avenue. Drivers diverted as police investigate. Here's the video again. The man in a black t-shirt and backwards hat getting back into his vehicle after firing his weapon. Police say he went on to shoot himself. So far, it's unclear why he did this. We don't know the relationship between the subject and the victims. Now you heard Detective Sierra say it right there. Miami-Dade police investigators are still looking into uh, how these three victims may all be related. The motive behind this horrible incident. This investigation scene is still active. Reporting live in Southwest Miami-Dade, Syrah Onward, Local 10 News.